1023. Sunburn L. I can only affect this one side. Both of my arms are red. I have a slushy to cool off my arms and to eat. Alright, well, so. Alright, we're Kara. And last time we were here, we were cleaning up this buffoon's house. And why? Don't ask me why, because I don't even know why. This fool is just too freaking lazy to do it himself. Uh, Archie. Bring Todd a beer. Didn't I just do that, you lying soccer tank? Take the beer. Bust it over his head, knock him out, run away forever. Take the child with you. Don't actually do that, but yeah, this game you should. Okay, bring Todd a beer. What else? Urgent task, optional. This is washed, got trash, report the time. Activate vacuum cleaner, check the backyard. Where is the vacuum cleaner? Where exactly is freaking vacuum cleaner? Out of the way for fuck's sake! I'm sorry, Todd. They won't happen again. He is. He is the literal definition of someone who should be punched in the face. Literal definition. To give a pow right in the kisser. Annoying, weeping. He's a, he's a, he's a no. Oh, she's on the, she's on the, the, the chair now. Why when I'm fixing to say couch? Where is the vacuum cleaner? Is it upstairs? Clean house. I can't do it if I don't know where the cleaner is at. Wait. Is it in here? Uh, no. What, what do you think I'd be up there for? Where's the Hoover? Where's the cleaner? Where is it? Is it? Is this, no, that's a friggin' moth bucket. What? Can you not vacuum? Where if it's out here, <laughs> Jesus Christ, it's dark out here. Why is there a tire back here? Does any of this need to be done? Now, oh, I have to take down the laundry. Okay. Oh, what's this? Take. Oh, it's the, the bin for the clothes. Okay. Who's texting me? here at the train outside. I have to rewash the laundry. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Aren't you going to school today? You look bored. Would you like to play a game? No. Washing machine, not three, two. Why do you have two washing machines? Take that. She, I don't think she remembers how to, though, does she? What's that? You shouldn't mess around with my stuff. It makes me nervous. I'm sorry, Don. You just stay the fuck out of my business. Unless you want to piss me off. You want to piss me off? No, Don. I was washing your dishes. Don't keep your shit in something that you used to clean your freaking clothes with. Burn that man. So you need to burn him. The human doesn't even look like it's been empty. Also, how would he even know? Laundry's being rewashed. Laundry. Where is. I don't know where the vacuum cleaner's at. Wait a minute. No. <laughs> I bet it was over here. It's not over here. Where's the laundry? The vacuum cleaner! Where is it? I don't know where the vacuum cleaner's at. <laughs> Look how she stands. That's cool. I don't know where the vacuum cleaner is at, dude. You gonna tell me where it's at? Oh. Stop that right now! Bruh, let's- you always pushing me? She, she's just playing around! She's just playing around! You need to chill out, dude. Alice, you wanna come with me? I'll take care of you better than this slob of a guy. <laughs> Someone was saying my name. <laughs> I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do what you have to do and stop bothering me. You know what? Why don't you go jump off a cliff? How about that? Since you want to be such a hard ass all the time. I'm sick and tired of it. In person. <laughs> Alice's toys. Okay. Tidy Todd's room, Tidy Alice's room, clean bathroom. Oh god, this is his room. Oh god.
she did that fairly quick. Okay, clean mess. I'd be glad to take him to the trash can. Cause he is a mess. He is the mess. trash in here though. Why does he have all of this just lying around? You have a kid in the house. How oh, the cops not taken her from you yet? Tidy that. Gotta love an icy, especially on hot days like this. ever get his act together, maybe then he he won't be such a mess. Yellow mean new information? Then a light room. Oh god. Uh the music controller, that's right. Hey, his room's done. Watch it. I punch him. Punch him. I ain't gonna go in your bathroom after you just used it. But oh, it's his room. He has two bathrooms? Why is... I just want to tidy up your room a little. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? Why is there a log on the outside of her door? Why? Where's the common logic in that? Girl, you need you need to speak up, man. You can't. This isn't healthy for you. Alice in Wonderland. Of course. Hmm. Kara, be be a woman and fucking punch Todd in his flat square face. Ventilate. Oh. Okay. My ear it is. Oh. I want like dialogue or action often beneficial. What? Oh, I can talk to Alice. Ah, oh, no. Neil. Friendly. I'm sure we used to be friends before I was reset. 
Maybe we can be friends again. You should tell me about yourself. What you like to do, where you like to go, your favorite foods. That would really help me. <laughs> your father said you chose my name. Kara, it's nice. How did you choose it? What about your mother? Will she be yeah. home soon? Show her issues. What did she just... What, what did she take? Oh, she gave me a, a key? Thank you, Alice! More story! Oh, my hand is warm. That's not good. <laughs> Urgent task. Okay. I didn't even finish the bathroom, though. I like how she like walks over the book. <laughs> I didn't even don't I have to? Clean bathroom, clean restroom. What's the difference between a bathroom and a restroom? You just like rest in the room while you bathe in the other room? I swear, this house is a total dumpster fire. That man needs to be arrested. Just send Alice with car and send them at their own freaking house. That's it. Then they, they'll be happy. I'm telling you. Uh, why, why can't I clean the bathroom or the restroom? Apparently, because apparently. The game thinks that the bathroom and the restroom are two different things. <laughs> I, I can't do anything. It's optional tasks. Clean bathroom. And clean the restroom. I, I just... Okay. Well then. family? Don't you think I tried to make things work? But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up! I know what you think of me. You hate me. You hate me, don't you? Say it! You hate me! I wouldn't blame her if she did hate you, dude. You, you're supposed to be her fucking father! <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. No! Screw you know that! Don't you? you know I love you. I, I'm starting to think that Alice named the Android Kara because her mother's name was Kara. That's what I'm beginning to think. Control, control and light just freaking turn different colors. Continue. November 5th, 2038. About the same day. This. I. I don't even know what this saying. This is the artist one. He has like the palette of paints. Marcus? What is his name? Deposit package. Put down. Oh, he took off the coat. Okay. Package collected. Deposit package. This is a nice house. Wait, Carl upstairs. Carl is in from The Walking Dead? 
That's the only other Carl I know. I don't know why my voice is I'm doing that again. This is room. Draw curtains. I'm assuming it is his room. <laughs> Good morning, Carl. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees, 80 percent humidity, with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. This sounds like a good day to spend in bed. <laughs> I did go to pick up the paint that you wanted. Minister Carl's medicine. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? Okay, so his name is Marcus. so quickly all this effort to keep him gone okay I'll take you to the bathroom now don't tell me I have to actually keep okay I, at least I don't have to move him I just gotta keep Holding L1 and up. What is that cat? Take Carl to dining. Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. The gallery director left four um. messages asking to confirm your attendance. Hmm. I haven't decided yet. Uh, we'll see about that later. Where? Okay. What else? I Just your <laughs> usual fan mail. I've already answered. Hmm. Any uh. news from Leo? No, Carl. Okay, I, I was fixing to say. No. no, I don't bother. I keep forgetting that that there are those things now. I, I don't know what they're called. Dining table, I'm assuming, is this way? Starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't even know at this point what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, my. oh it's right here. Doors are cool. Thank you. Television. Oh. 
see, this this dude knows how to care for an android. I don't know what the other dude's doing. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carl. Find something to do. I... what? Exactly what? I can't go in there. Sure as hell can't use those stairs. Can't go in there. Television awful. Mankind is so depressing. Nothing but greed, stupidity, and violence. Five thousand years of civilization just to get to where we are. Uh, okay. <laughs> That's the kitchen. Wait. Is that where I'm supposed to go? No. I completely lost where I'm supposed to go. Read a book. Oh god, no. Find something else. I don't know any of those except, well, obviously Shakespeare I know. How does- what, there's not even an opening to the staircase. Chess. I don't know what to do. Spin. <laughs> Screw it, I'm gonna read. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself and make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. Or not read. Pausing that, that way I can take a little sip. What flavor is this again? Cherry Frost. for my hands to defrost. Okay, so I gotta take Carl to the studio. Which is where? I assume it's like the, the door I try to go through first. I assume. Okay. 
<laughs> I was right. Didn't mean to be right. I never even played the game before. Just take the mill off in it. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheep. Remove sheet, what? Oh, so beautiful. Clean studio, what exactly do I need to clean? Certainly not. The paint splashes everywhere. What's your verdict, Marcus? Ah! Yeah, I there is something time. about it. Hmm. Something I can't quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. <laughs> Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting some. Paint? What would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give Enemy. it a try. There's nothing even on the palette. Do I have to add palette? The, the paint? I need a subject to paint. Paint a statue. Okay, so it's touch control. The thing. That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world, it's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. But... Go on, go. Try it. Grab that canvas. Okay. <laughs> Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate. Fish walking on land. On how it makes you feel. And let your hand drift across the canvas. Under its humanity, identity. 
Ooh, humanity. Anger. Just keep going side to side. Doing it, what? There, but, but didn't you do it? I, just, I was kept, I kept doing it. Why didn't I do it? Oh god, <laughs> that's terrifying, but freaking cool. Hey, Dad. Leon. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave? It just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash. That's all. Sorry. The answer is no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah. Yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's he got that I know? Smarter? More obedient? Not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough! Enough! Hey, can you... You don't care about pillow. anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. So yeah, uh -huh. that happened. Connor boy. No androids allowed. He can go in anyway. <laughs> Fuck the rules. Jimmy Peterson. Edward Dempsey. Christopher Gray. Derek Myers. Looks suspicious. Jonah, 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 Jonah Graham. Uh, I don't know why I couldn't even think of the name. Mm -hmm. 
Get this Glenn looking dude. Kim Johan. Hank Anderson, okay. Lieutenant Anderson, my name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyclife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. So just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Listen, I think you should stop drinking and come with me. It'll make life easier for both of us. I understand that some people are not comfortable in the presence of androids, but I am perfectly comfortable. Now back off before I crush you like an empty beer can. <laughs> you know what? I'll buy you one for the road. What do you say? Bartender, the same again, please. Do that, Jim. Wonders of technology. Make it a double. <laughs> Connor's face like boy. <laughs> oh. Did you say homicide? Needed needed him to get him to be reasonable in a way. Gonna roll up their music blasting. Wow. You wait here. What do you want? Whatever you say, Lieutenant. Fucking A when I'm resting. <laughs> I have to follow him? Oh, come on. Josh Douglas for Channel 16. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Androids are not permitted beyond this point. It's with me. <laughs> it's right. What part of staying in the car didn't you understand? Your order contradicted my instructions, Lieutenant. You don't talk, you don't touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Go. That one had to. <laughs> we were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan until this asshole found me. So, you got yourself an android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a call around 8 from the landlord. Oh, I oh, had his rent for a few months, so he thought he'd drop by, see what was going on. That's when he found the body. even yeah. worse before we open the windows. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. According to the neighbors, he was kind of a loner. He stayed inside most of the time. They hardly ever saw him. Oh, stayed easy. It wasn't worth calling everybody out in the middle of the night. Could have waited till morning. Hey, I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here. Probably the murder weapon. Red ice. That's the same thing Kara found. Sound of a break in. Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his hand? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. Yeah, no lights. No fingerprints. I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. You gonna taste the blood? Ugh. I'm 
tried, but... Briefing concluded. I <laughs> see the little jack o' lantern right there. this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. We're taking samples for analysis. Analyze, yeah. Regular letters, font, cyber life, sands. Okay, I guess we're investigating the corpse. Multiple stab wounds. 28 knife wounds. Well then. Internal bleeding, 28 stab wounds, deceased more than 19 days ago. Ugh. Anything else? Oh, okay. Red ice. Okay, so that's the drug. Deceased, obviously he's dead. Don't tell me information I already know. One more. Oh, he's right here. Fingerprints. Database match. Ortiz. Carlos Ortiz. Criminal record. Theft and aggravated assault. Okay, reconstruct. Okay, so this is from 19 days ago. Okay. So he's right here. Tripped over, victim fell here. The victim was stabbed. Okay. There's another one. What's this? They came from the kitchen. Okay. Seems like the killer really had it in for. Apparently. You have it in a score out of ten. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked to party. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Hey, Mike, you finished taking samples there? Yeah, that's it. Oh, there's more over here. I can't do anything else now. Oh, wait. Fingerprints. Uh, signs of a struggle. He was trying to fend off the thing or whoever he was fighting against. Deviant took a knife. Okay. Deviant was attacked. Emotional shock. Okay, should we just do this? Oh. Oh. I don't know what that said. 
report to report to Anderson. I only got ten. I only didn't get all ten. I want to review all of it. What is this? That's just outside. Okay. Is that also outside? Yes, it is. Oh. Okay, no, not reading that. <laughs> you know what? Let's just go to Anderson. How about that? Where is he? Oh, it's right here. Turn around. Connor. Lieutenant, I think I figured out what happened. Oh, yeah. Shoot, I'm all ears. It all started. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. Question is, what exactly happened here? I think the victim attacked the android with the knife. No, oh. that can't be right. It doesn't fit the evidence. Wait. Ah, I think the victim. With the bat. Yeah. But I th that lines up with the evidence. Go on. I was already free. Because I keep thinking that the victim is the. God damn it. Get them stab the androids. The no. android through the chair. The story no. makes no sense. You gotta stick to the facts. I am breaking. Button happy. The, the android, android stabbed the victim. That's so when I met the button. Was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to the living room. The living room. sense. The android murdered the victim with the knife. Yeah. Okay. okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous. It doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some therium. Lost some what? Therium. You yeah. call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' biocomponents. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, but I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. Correct. So still going this way. Oh no, he didn't. He went this way. I'm supposed to be like. <laughs> I'm supposed to be examining it. I'm not. The ladder was used. Right. When they 
finish this offering. That chair. I'm going to check something. Y'all, why is he even mannequin in his attic? That's the most random thing ever. Oh, but didn't leave a massive handprint. I see scuff marks of it. He's still bleeding. Healing. That's not a good sign. Okay. Oh, Atlas. In the kitchen. I did what I could. Turn on the light.
Serve Alice and Todd. How? Life's That's funny. Me. I lost my job because of androids. And I need somebody to take care of this goddamn house. Oh. Do you go out and hire a fucking android. I'm doing it. Okay, there it goes. Joke. There we go. Androids are so fucking wonderful. They never fail. They never tired. They never sad. They're so fucking perfect. They ruined my fucking life. Yeah. Androids are the reason why. What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. She's my fault just your fucking a kid. mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. I fucking whore walked down on me for a fucking account, It's all your fault. Daddy knows. It's all your fucking fault. Uh, excuse me? No. Get back here. Cara, don't just, don't, don't you just freaking here. sit there. Come back here right now. Cara, freaking murder this dude. He needs to be murdered. Cars is like I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stand here. <laughs> this dude needs to go to prison. Which he deserves. Just I need a little hit. You stay there. Don't you dare fucking move. Or I'll bust you worse than last time. Don't move. You know, he needs to go to prison. Shit about how I felt. Everything I could to make her happy. I just wasn't good enough for her! Yes. This dude needs to go to prison. Fucking bad. You don't just hit. You, first of all, you don't hit your own kid. He needs to go to prison. Respect. No, Alice, don't you in there. Mad. You deserve to be taught a good lesson. Uh no. I will uh, I swear to God, I would I would murder this dude. <laughs> that ain't no joke. I would murder this dude. Protect Alex, yes. Here we go.
No, enter. Please stop, good. That's enough. Leave her alone. What the fuck are you doing? Get out of here. That's an order. You hear me? No. I want you to leave Alice alone. You want? What do you mean you want? You don't want anything. You're just a goddamn piece of plastic. A piece of plastic that can kick I your ass. Problem. We need to fix that. She's an android. <laughs> oh! 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 Watch out, Kara! <laughs> oh! you do bust his ass <laughs> come on Alice let's go let's go Alice open door Craig he's coming hurry hurry up car don't don't, don't even think about it. Don't even think about it. Go. Go. Let's go. Little kid, okay? Should have killed him though. We are free. Yes. <laughs> That's my by far my favorite ending right there. Far the best ending. Go ahead and play one more chapter and I'm gonna end it. <laughs> that was by far the most boring party I've been to in the last 25 years. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, what the hell am I doing here? <laughs> I hate cocktail parties. All the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about art. All they care about is how much money they're gonna make out of it. Come on, let's have a drink. Oh, the excitement of this whole thing has made me thirsty. <laughs> I like Carl. Scotch, neat as usual? Absolutely. Okay, but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, you can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. <laughs> Did you leave the light on in the studio? No, no, I'm sure I didn't. 
Call the police. Detroit Police? What's your emergency? This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break-in. A patrol car is on the way. Let's go check it out. Marcus, no, I'm gonna come with you. You sure about that? Leo! What are you doing? You refuse to help me, so I'm helping myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them! Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here! Make Leo leave. Be reasonable. This isn't gonna get you anywhere. All you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? Not good enough for you? Not perfect, like this fucking thing. That's enough! Get out! Right now! What makes what? it so special what? anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't Leave him alone! Come on! Let's see what you got! Marcus, don't defend yourself, you hear me? Don't defend yourself. Don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. What you waiting for? Think you're a man? Act like one. Stop it! What's the matter, too much of a pussy? Stop it, Leo! Stop it! Just scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! Stop! Do I have to do it? You're just a fucking piece of plastic. No, Leo, leave him alone. No. I'm gonna destroy you. It's gonna just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart. And nobody's gonna give a shit. Because you're nothing. You hear me? You're nothing. I'm gonna because I don't want Carl to do anything. Carl, no. I think he's dead. If it weren't for you. The android. Who's the android? Thanks. How are you gonna shoot Marcus though? Self-control. Leo accused Marcus. Can I get the ending where I beat up Mark? Uh, no, Mark. <laughs> Can I get the ending where I beat up Leo? Can I do that? <laughs> That's freaking bull, dude. How are you gonna blame Marcus? He ain't. Oh, shit. <laughs> he ain't do shit. But it, I think Carl's death was more Leo's fault. Because him being there trying to force inheritance onto himself from his own father that was gonna die probably a lot later on had he not just shown up like that did what he did and caused his own father to go into cardiac arrest or give him a heart attack that's 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 messed up man very messed up side note I'm glad that Kara and Alice are 
finally away from him. That was good. Kara did what was right. <laughs> Although I would have, I, I would have gone to the extreme. I would have. Okay, uh, this will be continued on in the next episode. After party. Oh wait, would he have, would he have survived had I went alone? Would he have survived if I went alone? If so, can I redo this whole thing? <laughs> I'll see you next time. <laughs>